business was the hardest part for me, you know, early on and, and all the way up until probably 10 years ago, it was, you know, I was all focused on learning plumbing and the newest things in plumbing and, and not focusing on, on the, on the business side of it. And boy, I can tell you, you know, the reading and to answer your question specifically, you know, I did go online and, and most of my, my mentors weren't really plumbing coaches or anything like that. It was more just entrepreneur, entrepreneur coaches, you know, people with yep. just really good business minds and strategies because Plumbing is just like any other business. It's just a vessel. It's yeah, yeah. You, you've got to choose what your vessel is and you've got to run it like a business. And, and it doesn't matter if it's plumbing, if it's making hamburgers or if it's whatever your business is, it has to be run the same way. It starts with understanding every single role that, that there is inside that business model that you have. If it's 20 different hats that meet that criteria of running that business, you've got to know what each 20 of those hats are and have a plan for it, you know, yeah. and, and know how to, and know how to give those hats away one hat at a time until you're not wearing them anymore. 